Hola, buenas tardes. Good evening, my beautiful people. Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl here, Daniela, La Planning Diva. And I just set up my March monthly in my flagship planner. I use a big happy planner and I'm so excited with what I did with the cover. Look at this cover. Isn't this fantastic? I love this thing so much. This is a Lucky Charms box of cereal cover. I cut this out of a literal box of cereal because I loved it so much. And I added some sparkly vinyl on top of it. The back, I added some scrapbook paper and some washi. Um, it's honestly a little rough around the edges, but I love it so much. Anyways, um, I just set up this monthly. That was probably the last video that I uploaded. And I actually went ahead in that video and decided the theme for each weekly spread. So this week I decided I was going to do a pressed floral spread. I'm going to do just a general spring spread uh, for the next week. And then a Lucky Charms spread. And then another spring spread. And then a desert theme for the last week of March. Anyways, um, I'm going to pull these pages out of my planner and I am going to use my pressed florals sticker book and my pressed florals accessory book to set up the spread. And I'm definitely feeling in the mood to just zone out, so I'm probably going to do a voice over. I hope you don't mind, but let's get started. Okay, so the very first thing I started off with was laying down some beautiful washi tape at the bottom there and I'm using my Cafecita Designs a washi tape cutter to cut it and this washi is a beautiful spring themed washi from Simply Gilded. I actually got this in a subscription box from last year. It's gorgeous. I love the white little bunnies in it and then I went ahead and laid down some of those larger clear quote stickers from the pressed florals sticker book and I also added some cute floral washi that I got from actually the squad girls package um, that came out around um, Black Friday I believe and then I just started laying down some long boxes some like three-quarter boxes some full boxes um, both boxes and just um, decorative full box stickers I had no particular design in mind when I was laying down these stickers I just kind of wanted wanted it to be cute and functional so I made sure to add some checklists using my clean color dot markers and then I also made a note that I had an appointment on Thursday I actually have um, a an appointment scheduled with my surgeon just to check in on how my inner ear is healing from my stapedectomy and then following that i just lay down some checklist boxes i really like these boxes with the little tab on the side i really wanted to use up the entire page of those so i went ahead and just laid one down almost on every single day this week and then this was something fun that i did differently i used the pressed flower paper stickers to line the top where the dates of the week are and then i used my fisker scissors to trim off the excess sticker paper hanging off the edge and it looks so so good i'm so happy with how it turned out um, i'm always trying to figure out ways to decorate that top section up there because I feel like I always neglect this, this section. I always kind of leave it kind of empty and it always looks kind of just like a hole, like a black hole or more like a white hole that it feels like dead space and so I'm really trying to focus on you know um, making sure I'm not forgetting about that top section and I'm slowly getting over my um, resistance of covering up the dates but honestly I know what each column stands for I'm not gonna forget about it just because I don't see the week dates at the top there and if I allow myself to cover those dates it really opens up a lot of possibilities about design um, layouts so I'm trying my hardest to be creative there at the top and then following that I just lay down some more boxes some more quote stickers some thin washi there on 
the right side of the page and I just also added some cute clear pressed floral stickers. I think those look so beautiful. This pressed florals theme is my, one of my all-time favorite themes that Happy Planner has ever come out with and I've gone through an entire sticker book of the pressed florals and this is actually my second pressed florals sticker book and I'm sure I'm going to finish it just as quickly as I finished the first one. And then, oh, I also forgot to mention that this yellow daisy uh, sticker, the box sticker that I laid there at the top um, left of the page is one of my all-time favorite stickers of all time. It's just such a cute design. I love it so much. And so I wanted to put it in a really like important place for me in the spread just to highlight how cute that sticker is. And then what I ended up doing here was I'm just cutting out, I think, I think I am. I think I'm just punching out um, the the holes with my crop dial, the ones that were covered with the washi. And then I think I was messing around with <laughs> something on the back. I don't remember why I just left my spread there for so long. Um, as I'm doing the voiceover right now, I'm just wondering why I'm, I just left my spread like that for so long. Oh well, I think in a second here we're gonna pick up. Oh yeah, I think, I, oh now I remember. I actually went to go get this sticker book, The Essential Dates and Numbers, because I wanted to at least put the numbers at the top of the columns. I first started off with using these clear stickers, but you can't really, um, see them through because the background is so colorful so i decided to go with these um, more yellow and pink paper stickers and you can really see those stickers and i just love how this spread came out okay i think we're done here and i love how it turned out i mean it's hard to go wrong with the pressed florals and actually i don't know if i mentioned this but this is the second sticker book of pressed florals that i have had i finished up the first one completely and so this is the second one that i've had and that's why it was so completely new because i actually hadn't really dived into this after I finished up the entire sticker book um, a while back. I also have the accessory book as well. Love both of them. I love pressed florals so much. It's one of my favorite um, sticker books that Happy Planner has come out with. But I am in love with the spread and it's definitely getting me in the mood to go hang out in the desert this weekend and check out the super bloom. So let me tuck this um, back into the rings or the discs I mean oh, I love it it looks amazing I'm very happy with this I love how I put the pressed florals up there at the top I'm really trying to decorate this top section a lot and really focus on it because I feel like I neglect it a lot and I think it looks so much better when it's all filled in anyways thank you so much for spending so much time with me here today I really appreciate it let me know what you think in the comments down below and I hope to see you in my next video so until then stay safe stay blessed and happy planning bye